Hello, ladies and gentlemen. I'm the Marmoset. We're back with Animalia. Having fixed the roads and the bus lines, and I know there's all debris kind of buildings which will shortly be dis disappearing, we're now in a position where we can actually put in our cargo terminal. I'm going to try and get it at a reasonable point along here so that the ships aren't doing UEs quite so badly. So, now we've got that in. Um, we've got power. We'll probably sort itself out in a bit because that's still connected, so it's good. Water we have. Uh, let me just plug. Really? That hole in the network. And then we will look at seeing how we can, we can connect this in. Now we want it one way. Now experience has told us with the rail yard, which is here, they like to go in to that kind of area from going left then from going left to right. We've got lanes there that aren't being used. Not helpful. When we want to be getting people out of there. It's time to hit the upgrade button. Bingo. Let's leave that be and just get that sorted out. But yes, now we have our hot terminal. We want to plug some roads into it. So I'm going to be guessing they'll probably be coming on the left hand side. So we want to come in this way with our one way road. So we will start from about here. No. Probably the best is to do come out from this way. and then reverse the road. And then... Grab you... Grab that one... Pretty much... So it'll take a while for the pathing to sort itself out. But there we go. We have our tunnels. To connect our illustrious harbour. Not enough electricity. No electricity available. Are you not? No, we have enough electricity. Does this not count? Just because I can, really. What's our first little bit of space? Yes, there we go, it does sort of out, doesn't it? Apparently that wasn't quite of enough of a connecting network. Hmm, I saw, I saw a truck come in and out there.
Yes, you have trucks, definitely. That was a garbage truck. And another garbage truck. Oh, but that was a truck that a... That truck came from somewhere. That truck came from somewhere. Oh, we're going to see a truck come this way. Really? I just built that. I just built it, and it's on fire. It's on fire again. Uh. How is the end of the crane even on fire? Well, now we've got a real test to wait and see. Just how long will it take the fire department to get a truck out to my nice new harbour? <laughs> it's going to burn down. Brand new. Brand new. There, oh, there we go. Yay! They finally arrived. <laughs> I wonder where they had to come from. I'm just going to check my fire crews. Ultimately, we're just going to need to probably install a fair few more of these. Because apparently industry likes, you know, spontaneously combusting. Makes them happy, if nothing else. Well, we do have some harbourside officers. They need highly educated workers, so they'll, they'll fit in a little bit of residential demand. But yeah, it looks like we do have our first cargo ship. Glitching like hairy Jar Jars, but then spewing out quite a collection of trucks onto our network. I don't know if I like the idea of you turning left there. But no, I don't want you turning left there at all. Traffic presidents. Change lane arrows. No lights. Go left as if it was a slip road. A few of you are going to take a while to sort your pathing out. But once you've done that... I do want that flowing freely. No sure avoid any lights there. Yep, that's baffing out trucks and transport. And here's a cruise ship. And even some people waiting for it. Waiting for the buses. That's quite a change. Yes, that's working quite nicely. I think one thing we are going to probably need to include is some more taxis. Because we've only got... Let's just have a quick check of taxis. Find new land. I know. We've got the residential demand. Are you people never satisfied? Um, not actually taking that many people. We probably should... Put a taxi stand in there and put another taxi point in to service our good citizens. I think I will probably also put another taxi stand in the heart of this district. All right. So that's still being pretty awful. <laughs> you can make this just this hideous, hideous network of. roads and connection points. Let me try and find a way of getting... Yep, I just dunked that guy in the river. You try and desperately find a way of making this not too awful. I don't know, that might have worked. Let 
me about zoning. Well, that's a busy bus. I don't know why you're trying to go over there. There's a large playground reasonably close to where you are. Stupid people. Yeah, I don't doubt it's burned down. Do you have a fire station over here? Pretty sure I do. I seem to remember building one. Yes, it's there. And yes, all your crews are no engines in you. So, quite why you can't get down to the building that was burning down just over there, I do not know. Yeah, ground them. <laughs> I may or may not just be randomly and arbitrarily pushing buttons at random now, but apparently they are. They can't put, can't join that up. I'm just upgrading roads now. This is kind of a cam. <laughs> More power? Oh dear. It's true. Running out of power. Fortunately, I have a vast amount of money. So, let's, um, stick. More of these. Merry gentlemen. I think we will at some point in the distant future be getting the nuclear power plant because it just produces such a large wad of power. And I will be very happy to see such a large chunk of power. Uh, let's just have a quick check of our statuses. Electricity ready. Water availability is poor. I would like more pumping. Pump more, my pumpy people. I also need to apparently make sure we have more outlet capability. Pump more, my pumpy people. Incineration status is weak. Do with more incinerators. Okay, I'll do what I've uh, been doing previously, which is kind of centralizing them a bit. But uh, let's. Extend this road to do there, and garbage, 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 incinerators. One, two, three, four, and five. We've finished emptying. I'm gonna probably get rid of you, and then replace you with. Just a little bit of industrial, because I don't want to. Those treatments and healthcare is good, crematorium, jails, elementary schools. Education. Where would you like a new elementary school? Only one for that entire district, I'll stick one right on the cusp. <laughs> Two in there.
Hmm. Apparently these people have been leaving. Seems a bit weird. Um, we'll stick. I don't want to any about. Don't want enough customers. Frame rate is high. Well, okay, we'll deal with that in just a second. It's a problem solving episode, ladies and gentlemen. It's a problem with all these curved roads. It's really not a lot of space to put very much. High school availability. Just how high a density do you end up with? In some of these places. I think we should solve that one. And uh, university is good. Our employment percentage is really good. Getting a demand for commercial. That's interesting. It is interesting. I don't have any immediate space for a new commercial district. Hmm. Looks like we might be going out this way. So, future plans involve putting some kind of pseudo roundabout in here, destroying all of this edge, and putting a road that basically goes along the edge of it, and then building into this area. So we have to have a d quite a high demand for commercial. Hmm. Well, we could quite easily kill two birds with a single well placed stone there. Do I re rig that area, or do I start looking at the donkey mines? But not I actually want to extend it down to this tiny little corner. No, let's not extend it into that little corner. Let's. Tidy that off over there. And let's make ourselves a little commercial zone on the end here. Uh, let's get the nice roads. And let's make ourselves a triangle. Then have one go straight across the middle. There we go. Grand. Okay, let's. That reminds me, did I ever put. I did put a bus route in there. That's nice. And let's put. Yep, okay, round. Let's see, you're not quite plumbed in. I can fix that relatively easily. Good. Alright, there's plenty of power in the area. And let's make you... High density. Make you your own little district. Well, it kind of looks like that. It's got a tree pointy kind of thing to it. Let's call it hmm, the Avery. I have no idea if that's how you actually spell Avery or not. But let's click the policies button. We would like, well, there's not much point putting parks and education in here, or we might put a park one in. We're not going to put anything in school out, education boost, recycling, taxation, tax rise, tax relief, city planning, encourage biking, yeah, fine by me. Uh, industrial space planning, overlooking fewer work safety laws. No, I think I'm good with that. Thank you very much, my phone, for the very loud, noisy binging to remind me we got this point. Big business, big, big business. Uh, yeah, let's do that one. Small businesses, yes. 
No, we want high density in this area. So, the aviary. There we go. With our new little small high density commercial zone. We've got a lot of people hauling in and out of here. Yeah, I do think in the not too distant. Whoa! <laughs> you just got a lot of trucks. It's simply put, a lot of trucks. Hmm, alright, well let's um, fall back on the old adage of uh, upgrading to a larger road. Hmm. It's just busy. It's busy. It's busy, 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 busy. Yeah. Okay. So, bits and pieces of the system are working reasonably well. Primarily, these are the ones that don't evolve where I have to do any traffic planning. Or any kind of planning that might be considered sensible. That all painted in, that's what I'm that's what I'm doing. Yep. It's a nice idea with the canals. I quite like the canals. I'm reasonably pleased with the canals. Just think we need to have a good long talk about how we're going to get people in and out of this city. That made perfect sense. <laughs> Doo -doo, doo -doo. Just staring at these things going, oh dear god, it's all gone horribly, horribly wrong. Um, <laughs> yes, of course, there's a school there. <laughs> Movings, moving at the police station, moving at the crematorium, moving at the medical clinic, moving at the park, so I can get to that road. Moving at the fire station. Zoom all the way out, and then I will probably grab that one, the marquee tool, high density resolu residential, repaint. And then unpaint, high density commercial, repaint. And then I've got some buildings to move back. Thumping noises. That was the upgrade button. Oh well. I want that one. I want that one. No, 
many of those things. Yeah, so the buses are sorting themselves out. Yep, okay. Just going to need to do a little bit of repainting with my zones. I need a big brush. Where I've been playing around. Grand, okay. Yeah, okay. I think this is going to need some work off camera, so I'm going to play with that and then get back to you next episode. Thank you very much for watching, ladies and gentlemen. I've been the Marmoset, slightly extended edition where I thought quietly. Please remember to like and subscribe if you're enjoying this work with Ananalia. Bye for now. A horse, you. It's an enormous, great big horse, you. I've no idea if it'll work or not. I've upgraded all the rest of the other roads, and I'm just kind of painting back in the residential bits. But it might work. So far, it's not gone horribly wrong. I have no idea what it's done to the bus routes. Bye-bye.